Good day everyone. Today is Monday, December 19, 2022. Please sing with me, I see you Lord. I'm so blessed my Lord, I can see you. In all the lovely things so fine and true, I see you in the beauty of the flowers and the rain. I see you between the lines of a sweet refrain. I'm so blessed, my Lord, I can see you. Even when the lonely and in pain, I see you in the beauty of the stars at night. I see you in my life, I feel all right. I see you, Lord, in sorrow and in happiness. I see you in the glory of sweet success. I see you, Lord, every hour, every day. I can see you, Lord, whenever I pray. I'm so blessed, my Lord, I can see you In the smile of a baby, sweet and true I can see you in the eyes of my very best friend I see you in these bonds, just like the love you never end I see you, Lord in sorrow and in happiness, I see you in the glory of sweet success. I see you, Lord, every hour, every day. I can see you, Lord, whenever I pray. I see you, Lord. In sorrow and in happiness, I see you, Lord, in a sweet success. I see you, Lord, every hour, every day. I can see you, Lord, whenever I pray. I can see you, Lord. Whenever I pray. Today's gospel is taken from the book of Luke, chapter 1, verses 19 to 20. Faith or doubt? I am Gabriel, who stand before God. I was sent to speak to you and to announce to you this good news. But now you will be speechless and unable to talk until the day these things take place, because you did not believe my words, which will be fulfilled at their proper time. This is the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ. Imagine if the Archangel Gabriel appeared to you. What would that have been like? This particular Archangel stands before the incomprehensible beauty and splendor of the Most Holy Trinity and brings forth messages of the greatest importance. Gabriel is God's most notable messenger. Take a moment to ponder what such a glorious apparition would have been like. In the passage above, 
this glorious archangel appears to Sicaria as he is fulfilling his priestly duty to burn incense before the Lord within the Holy of Holies. As Zachariah enters the sanctuary while all the people remain outside praying, he suddenly has a vision of the archangel telling him that his wife Elizabeth will have a child, even though she is advanced in years. But even though Zachariah hears this message from Gabriel, the archangel who stands before God, he doubts what he is being told. Would you have believed the archangel Gabriel if you were Zachariah? Or would you have doubted? Though there may not be a way to know the answer to that question, it's helpful to ponder the humble truth that you very well may have doubted. It takes true humility to admit that possibility. Like Zachariah, we are all weak and sinful. We lack the perfect faith that our Blessed Mother had. And if you can humbly admit this, then you are in a great position to overcome the weakness of faith you struggle with. Zechariah suffered much for his lack of faith, but that suffering led to a renewal of faith when he named his child John in obedience to the archangel. Reflect today upon how well you listen to all that God says to you. Do you listen, believe, and obey? Or do you question and doubt God's voice? Know that God speaks to you each and every day. Admit the ways that you lack perfect faith and allow that act of humble acknowledgement to strengthen you where you need help the most. Amen. Let us pray in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, we know we lack the depth of perfect faith that we so deeply desire to have. We know that you speak to us day and night, and we fail to listen and obey. As we humble ourselves before you and confess our weakness of faith, strengthen us to respond more fully each day to all that you say to us. Jesus, we trust in you. For all of this we pray in the mighty name of Jesus, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless everyone, and thank you. Happy Monday!